Alright, in this problem we're going to be looking at a coffee cup that's traveling over a frictionless table at 2 meters a second. It's 3 meters from the edge, and the table is 1 meter high. Uh, the question is asking when and where will the coffee cup hit the ground? So we're looking for the distance, and we're looking for the time. So let's first figure out how long it's going to take the coffee cup to go across the table. You can do this by using the formula V times T equals distance, because there's no acceleration. 2 meters a second times t equals 3 meters, 2 equals uh, 3 over 2, so it equals 1.5 seconds. Now we need to figure out the time that it takes for the coffee cup to hit the ground from the top of the table. Uh, we can do this by using the formula distance equals 1 half acceleration times time squared. So we just plug in the numbers, so we have uh, 1 meter equals 1 half 9.8 meters per second squared times t squared. 1 meter equals uh, 4.9 times t squared. 1 over 4.9 equals t squared. Then the square root of 1 over 4.9 equals uh, t. So it equals about 0.45 seconds for the coffee cup to go from the top of the table to the bottom. All right, now we take the 1.5 seconds that it takes for the coffee cup to travel across the table, then add the 0.45 seconds that it takes for the coffee cup to hit the ground. So we get 1.95 seconds. And we plug it into the horizontal velocity equation, so it's just 2 times 1.95 equals 3.9 meters. So it traveled 3.9 meters from the start, or 0.9 meters from the edge of the table, and it took uh, 1.95 seconds.